Good evening. Portsmouth in Wales reached 27 degrees today, making it the warmest day of the year so far for Wales. Plenty of sunshine as well was enjoyed across the north of Wales, across Northern Ireland, Scotland, Northern England. The south had rather more cloud. This is a, a weather system that's been heading its way northwards. It's produced a few showers, the odd rumble of thunder as well as it's moving its way northwards. And that process continues through the night. Whilst the homegrown showers across Northern Ireland and the west of Scotland will tend to peter out. So it's a fairly quiet night. We will have more cloud, that said, for Scotland creeping in from Shetland across the North Sea. And that means it won't be as chilly as it has been in recent nights when we've had a touch of frost. And far from chilly in the south where it'll feel quite muggy and oppressive. Only 15 in some of the towns and cities. So Friday promises to be a repeat performance. We'll have some sea fog near the North Sea coast. We'll have a lot of cloud this time for the whole of England and Wales. Yes, it looks cloudier for North Wales, Northern England and the Midlands compared with today, but some good spells of sunshine coming through further north and that will encourage a few homegrown showers later. And there'll be a scattering of showers with our cloud in the south, but equally some dry, bright, even sunny weather to come. Into the weekend, it's a very similar story actually with just a few sharp showers around. The emphasis really has to be on a lot of warm, dry, bright weather, some strong sunshine coming through as well. So through Friday evening and overnight, the fine weather continues, the showers peter out and we'll find the development of some mist and low cloud again, particularly near the North Sea coast, which then as we move into Saturday will tend to disperse. And as you can see, it's back to that usual fine dry weather as the temperatures develop or lift. We'll start to see a few more showers perhaps across Scotland and Northern Ireland compared with the next couple of days. But again, into the low 20s are temperatures and those showers not for all by any shake. For any, by any shakes. Now we've still got that low pressure to the south, that's what will drive the cloud into the southern half of the UK. High pressure around towards the north, losing its grip a little as I say, which is why we'll see some of those sharpest showers through the weekend. Mostly again Scotland and Northern Ireland, large part of England and Wales seeing fine and dry weather, but these showers are deluge not too far away. So we are concerned about that, particularly as we wear into the start of the new week and we start to then see a change potentially. We'll pick up the jet stream and that'll push weather systems our way. But later in the week. Bye-bye.